Air traffic controllers work around the clock to guide air crews in and out of MacDill Air Force Base. This job requires their full attention, but they are in good hands. Retired Senior Master Sergeant Angela Hull works as the tower supervisor and shares the knowledge and experience she gained from a long military career. After 21 years of being able to help other people, I just couldn't imagine leaving it. Hull didn't stop. She continued doing what came naturally to her, teaching and molding the next generation of airmen. I get a lot of joy out of not just watching them grow up to be air traffic controllers, but watching them grow into well-rounded airmen, how they learn to put other people before themselves. And it really gives me a lot of satisfaction whenever I see it actually click for an airman, how important it is to not always put yourself first and to understand the core value of service before self. Focus on the airmen and their development shows when the experienced controllers train junior controllers with the same level of attention that Hull pays to them. I think that she knows when to be tough and when to be kind and I try my best to be that kind of a trainer as well because it's a no-nonsense career field and you can't always be nice. Sometimes you have to be firm. And I think she's taught me a lot about when to do that and when not to do that. Wow, you were close with no cigar. Although she no longer has to lace up her boots, Mrs. Angela Hull is still an airman in every sense of the word. Senior Airman Brad Tipton, McDill Air Force Base, Florida.